Welcome back to Traveling with Nick and Kim. I'm Nick. I'm Kim. And on today's video, guys, it's going to be simple. Renovation part two. We are adding curtains. How to hang curtains with binder clips. A quick, affordable, easy way to hang curtains in your van. Binder clips. Kim, what are you doing? I'm cutting the curtains for the windows. Is that supposed to be? You ain't had them Ooh. Sunday go to meet and pants on. Yeah. Okay, guys, so we measured one window after she cut it, and it's too short. So now she has to do some recutting. And, guys, we got this sheet from, is that a sheet? Or is it a tablecloth? Table yeah, it looks like a tablecloth. We got it from the thrift store for $2, maybe a dollar. All that from the top down. So this is good. I guess you could go a little long, a little long if you want to, or that might be good. And if you guys saw yesterday's video, I was in here cleaning up, removing the seats out. That seat still remains, which probably will come out. But um, so Kim's at work today doing her job. It is currently maybe 10, 15, 10, 12 in the morning. Yes. And um, here we are. Perfect fit. In the binder clips, you just clip it on to the end like this, and you fold these down. I'm gonna go ahead and put the other one on the other end. Now I'm gonna come hang it. When hanging, you stick this silver clip, silver piece right here on the inside of this. Bam, there you have that side. I'm gonna take this end piece right here and stick it inside of there inside of a van Did I now to the next window okay. same thing clipping the binder clip to the end of the curtain folding those down Let's go hang. Remember using the silver piece to the clamp? Pushing it down in there, just like that. Same as on this side, pushing this down in there and closing it. So I have a little space. And there you have it. Hanging curtains in a van using binder clips and sheets from the thrift store. 
and it's a little cricket at the bottom we might go ahead and cut it but it's only going to be up for sleeping and then guys so you see the little gaps the little gap right there all you do is the same thing i'm gonna try to do this with one hand because kim is inside so you would just snap it on like that like that and then you see the little part right there on the the rubber part you do the exact same thing and you just the silver thing right there you just stick it in that hole right there same way you can either fold it down or leave it up and you put as many as you want up there i'll put another one we'll put a i'll put another one right there if we need to but you can always tighten it move it down and make it tighter you can move it down just to make it tighter and guys it's sealed shut same way with this side or you could flip this the other way both of those and then this doesn't have to show like i did on this side but it really doesn't matter if you do it from the inside or you do it on the outside it doesn't matter so guys that's how you do it very cheap very affordable keep the peeping toms from peeping in looking at all this sexiness <laughs> Well, guys, that concludes our video for today. One for the money. Two for the show. Three to get missing. Gas up and let's go. Let's go. So the only thing we have to do now is kind of, that that's real tacky right there. That is very tacky. It looks like the same pit. Is measure that right there and cut that. And cut those. But guys, this is an easy way to hang curtains in your vehicle, in your van, by using binder clips. And we won't keep them up all the time, just probably when we're sleeping or if it's real sunny somewhere. But Kim did an excellent job, I think. Way to go. We still have to fool around with the curtains just to cover up the gaps, but you guys get the idea. I don't know why they got MC bills right there.